Hello everyone, my name is John Melisondra and today I'm going to teach you how to paint this wonderful landscape painting. So today I'm going to paint um, a volcanic eruption. I'm going to put also some buildings there in the bottom part which is uh, which are um, a ruin or broken building, something like that. And please don't forget to subscribe, be able to subscribe it and hit the bell button if you want to receive some future notifications of my new videos and tutorials. Okay, you can see all the materials there on the screen. You can see the five limited colors, the brushes that we need, all the things that we need to paint this painting. Okay, so I'm going to start now. I'm going to do a little sketching first. So I have here the number uh, 200 flat brush, small size flat brush. I have here the row number. And then my horizon will be on this part here, at the bottom part. Yeah, I don't want to put so much on the on the field, everyone. Yeah, it will be in the bottom, something like that. Because uh, the volcano will be very, very high or or very very tall, something like that. Maybe here. I want to put it here. Yeah, I think so. So that's it. So I'm going to paint first the sky. So I have here the blue and the white. There. So just blue and the white, everyone. With some white. And then I'll try to make the upper part darker. With some more blue color, something like that. There, I like this. Blue, everyone, it's so dark. Make some white here, yeah. Make the bottom part a little bit lighter. Then add white to make the uh, paints lighter. There, and then I will try to make some purple, blue, and the red. So I'm gonna put it on the bottom part here, everyone. There. And then I will try to make some greens for the bottom, for the field. So the field will be greenish. A little bit of brown also. Not just green and brown, but also some brownish stone. With the raw umbra. There. Uh, we can also add more yellow here. Yeah, so I have now the underpainting everyone. So it's still uh, wet, so I'm gonna let it dry first for at least five minutes and then we can turn back. 
Okay, everyone. So the paint is already dry now, and I'm going to start adding the details. So I'm going to start here, uh, adding the sky, and then I'm going to put the mountain here, and I'm going to start it with the clouds first. Yeah. So I will be using this number two nylon flat brush, and I mean number number eight nylon flat brush. It's a medium sized flat brush. I'm gonna mix for blue and the red to create some purple and then I'm gonna put some white to, to make some light purple So, I'm adding some clouds here. I can use a little bit of bluish color and white. To create some beautiful clouds. There, so you can, you can do whatever you want for the clouds. Okay, so I'm gonna put some white. I can blend a little more to create uh, blended clouds, okay? But maybe I will I will put now the mount or the I will put now the big uh, mountain or the volcano. So I'm gonna mix for a purple. It will be a little bit uh, brighter or lighter. Blue and the red. Yeah. There. Blue and the red and the white. Everyone. So I will put it here, on here. So this will be the. It will not be a perfect cone, everyone. Like the Mayun volcano. I just like to make it uh, look more volcano. Okay. more blue and the red and then white you can make it a uh, bluish You can blend more on the bottom part. Okay, there you go. I will mix more blue and the red. Yeah, and then some white there. More red. And some white. So this is just, this is still the underpainting everyone. 
Okay. Another painting of the distant mountain. you understand everyone while I am doing here what, uh, what I was I, what I am doing there so yeah we this is our this will be our volcano now and we are going I'm going to continue adding more clouds there I just want to make a bright light blue color on the clouds everyone because I will add some sort of um, some sort of uh, beautiful uh, smoke here so yeah that's okay so I'll just use this one, light blue color, white and uh, blue, yeah. I am using now the bristle flat brush. With this brush, I can blend a little better. I'm gonna put more blue to blend here, okay. a little bit uh, crumpled, I don't know. It's my first time using this brush for this job. So maybe I need to refine this more. Actually, this brush everyone is a little bit hard using uh, to use for this kind of uh, technique for the clouds. I have to blend more also. There, so I think my clouds is uh, enough for me. I don't want to focus mostly in the clouds there because later on I'll just cover that part there. So I just want to have a very beautiful clear sky on this painting. Yeah. Okay. So I have to paint now the details of the of this uh, mountain, okay? This uh, volcano. So I'm going to use this blue with a little bit of yellow. So I have to mix for blue green, everyone, and then white. I can mix it here. Uh, my light source will be coming from the left side so here will be my mm. 
the highlights will be on the left. Also put a little bit of raw umber just white and raw umber everyone there okay some little bit of brownish stones on the on the mountain or on this uh, volcano there you go and then I'm gonna mix for blue green so blue with a little bit of yellow and then white more blue yeah and then or maybe a little bit of red there okay this one is a little bit darker I need to lighten this up with the white I think this one is good. Okay, you can see now a little bit of greenish. I'm going to lighten this part. There. There, so you can see now those details. A little bit romber. Okay, so here I'm gonna add much more yellowish stone. Sorry about the very noisy neighbor. So blue and the yellow. And then white. So be much more blue green. And I think this one is so it's much more lighter. Okay, I'm gonna put more. So in here also, I think it's getting nice bro. <laughs> I think I'm gonna stop. So here I'm gonna lighten this one, everyone. Just uh, put a little bit lighter uh, blue green. Okay, so yeah, it's good. So you can see now everyone that the uh, volcano mountain uh, looks a bit realistic for me. It's good. I like how it look. I think I'm gonna put now the the what's called this the uh, the smoke on the top of the mountain because this is an erupting volcano. So yeah, I'm gonna put the smoke. So I think I will be using this the same brush. So I'm a bit excited with the smoke, everyone. 
blue and the red and then white more red then white there more red yeah the smoke will be will be a lot there So here I can put more. Sorry everyone about the nice. So yeah, just uh, circular strokes, something like that. Okay, so I I hope that the sound of my neighbor doesn't bother you. Okay, there you go. I need to do it faster, everyone, because I think they are getting noisier there. Okay, I'm gonna put some white, and then yeah, here, and then you can put some highlights because our light is coming from the left side, so I can also put the highlights on the left. Hopefully, you can use the br uh, the bigger brush. I think I can use, I will just use the bigger brush of that. Okay, so this one. Sorry everyone if uh, they are getting noisy. I don't know why they are doing that. Okay, I hope it will not be, <laughs> I will not be copyrighted by the sound. They are making because if you're gonna do if, uh, it, it'll happen, I will really delete this video, <laughs> okay? So, yeah, I just have to keep on uh, talking, everyone, so that the YouTube will not pick up the background sounds and it will not, I will not be copyrighted. Hopefully, I can transfer soon. So, I just put some highlights here. Yeah, some highlights on the there. Highlights on the smoke. Okay. There. looks good I think I can see now the smokes and then more here more highlights it will look like some clouds everyone there yeah. let's make it look busy okay so I have to keep on talking everyone <laughs> because they might hear uh, the YouTube might pick up the sound and I cannot get copyrighted so it's not good there so as you can see now uh, there's a smoke there uh, it's gonna erupt I think this volcano is going to here up uh, anytime sooner okay yeah it looks good just so simple and it looks good I like the I like the color there. I need to enhance the color here everyone so some parts I don't like I will be using a smaller brush now you have to make clear of some parts there so we have your white and the uh, light blue green there I'll just lighten this part here to make it look good. There, okay. Okay, 
Okay, so sorry about that sound, everyone. I don't really like that. Okay, so yeah, I have to keep on talking now because their sound is getting louder. I don't know if you can hear it or I am the only one, but it's uh, noisy. I don't like it. Okay. And they are just below me. Yeah, maybe soon I'm going to transfer to my new house. So hopefully I will do it soon. Because I can wait to do that. I can wait to have my own privacy. Where no one can bother me. I'm making videos like that. I am now living in an apartment. So I cannot control the noise. And also my room is not, uh, my room is not um, soundproof. So yeah, I cannot control it. I'm very, very sorry about that. But soon if I'm going to be in my new home, I will be, I think, it will not be noisy like this. I, I don't like noisy neighbors also. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like it, everyone. And also, it also bothering my, my concentration because I need to focus on my work. So yeah. Okay. So I hope you you still understand what I am doing there because uh, actually uh, I'm not sure if. Uh, I explained it good because uh, I'm really distracted with the sounds there. I'm really distracted, everyone. Sorry. There. Yeah. Well, their sounds not good. So. so I'm gonna put a little bit light brown there. Okay, there and there. Okay, and also everyone, I cannot stop it now because I have no other time, but I have to finish this one. Okay, so I think I will just do something like that for now. I will proceed down the bottom part because I have to finish it a bit faster. I am very, very sorry about that. I'm sorry because I'm really distracted with the sounds on my neighbors. Their sounds, their music, something like that. I hope, not, I hope it also stop. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna use this yellow and the blue and then white. There, and then I'm gonna use it so to create fields. So here everyone, I'm gonna put some fields. Okay. I hope that my video will not be copyrighted because I'm gonna delete this everyone. I'm gonna delete this on YouTube. So yeah. So that will be that will happen. I cannot control my neighbor because they are they are paying, they are also paying, I am paying, okay. I cannot wait to have my own studio. It is very... Okay. There, okay. Yeah, I have to finish it faster. Because uh, it's getting noisy. I have here... The blue and the red and then yellow there. It's a dark green everyone. Let's put some forest here. Okay, hopefully everyone is not so not so loud. I cannot really wait to transfer now. 
because I cannot concentrate with this kind of neighbors, okay? And also here, I'm gonna put a little bit near here. here. And also, I don't like their sounds. So here, yeah. Okay, so you have now some forest there. I am adding some forest on the distant so that like, we can see perspective that this is very, very far mountain. Blue and red. A little bit of yellow. Yeah. It's a romper. Ah, I don't like it. Nice neighbors. Hopefully you understand me, everyone. I really don't like it. Why I have this kind of neighbors? Yeah, anyway, Philippine neighbors they don't really respect. <laughs> okay, there. So we have now uh, some fires there. It's good. I'm gonna try to put some. I hope you can still see it. Okay. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna put some details here, some highlights. There. Just a bit everyone, I don't want to uh, make this so bright like that, just a little bit, enough to create some light on the forest or on the trees, okay, so that's it. there okay so I'm going to yeah I'm going to add first some some uh, a lot of uh, a lot of bushes there before I'm gonna proceed here so I have your yellow and the red I hopefully hopefully you don't you don't hear so much on the sounds so here I'm gonna put some some uh, bushes, orange bushes. I don't like their sounds, everyone. It's not good. I think that is, it's not good. Okay, so yeah, I'll just put a little bit of orange there. And then I will put some yellow. I need to do it faster, everyone. I'm sorry. I hope you can still understand my video. Because they are really bothering me. There. Okay. I can see now some golden colors there. I also put some red. Some reddish uh, tone of the lens, everyone. Don't like that. Until here. There. Okay, hopefully the... the I don't know this time. I'm really, really stressed with my neighbors. Hopefully you understand me. So here I'm going to try to put some different types of plants. Okay.
there okay so yeah on even on the simple uh things that i put there it looks good it looks uh it looks uh, plants and i'll just put one subject there in the front everyone which is i am thinking of uh of a building there a ruined building and yeah it will be finished yeah that will be my last part because i don't want to spend so much now because i'm really distracted with the neighbors sorry about that so i have here the rue amber the blue and the red so there is the kind of uh, building uh, ruins here there okay So everyone, maybe you really hear that sound very well in your part. Okay, so here. try to add now some details some highlights okay so here okay I have to finish it faster yellow and the uh... yeah sometimes I, I paint uh, at 1 a.m. everyone or late because they are very very nice see there I have no privacy so here the highlights okay sorry everyone I, I hope that you understand me now <laughs> I don't like it Very, very noisy. I don't like it. I can't wait to transfer. So, yeah, these are some kind of ruins. I'll just do it as fast as I could so that I will finish this painting. So, here, let's uh, try to put some. Uh, blocks here I am very really, very really distracted I'm sorry everyone I'm very really, very really distracted by the sound of the neighbors I'm very really, very sorry I hope that you understand So this is an old building. There you go. I'm not sure if I, the, the background noise is very, very clear to you, but it's very, very clear to me, everyone. Okay, so yeah. I'll just try to add more details. Okay. Let's try to retouch here. Thank you. 
Okay, so I hope that this uh, it will be clear to everyone. I'm not sure. Yeah, hopefully it's. Uh, I'll just put uh, some plants there to make it look good, to make it clear on that part there. I'll just put something that will. It will look good. Okay. I yeah, also put some bushes there also. So I have here the blue and the red and then yellow there more yellow so I'll just put some um, bushes now even here everyone Tapping technique. There you go, and then we can put now some highlights. Just a, a yellow is everyone until we get. So some yellowish. Okay. And then I'm gonna put uh, some with white to make it look uh, brighter. There. So it looks good. I mean, just so simple run, but it looks good. It looks just uh, as what I going to expect. Okay, so I'm going to let you see everything. Yeah, I think this painting is just very, very easy, and I think it's uh, just very simple for you. So I think uh, it's, it looks good. So I will just try to retouch. So you have here the raw umber with the white. with a little bit of bluish yeah i think uh blue and uh, light purple and white okay blue and red and then longer okay so yeah thanks thanks for that they are now they know uh, now uh, stop it 
Okay, so yeah. Let's just put a little bit of darks. That is some kind of a ruins, everyone. Something like a, a ruined building there or yeah, something like that, so. And I will try to put, I'm gonna use this brush, small brush. Okay, so, raw umber. put some tinier beautiful details here of a ruin uh, or a dead uh, tree okay Just to make this uh, painting everyone a bit of exciting. Looks good. Thanks, God, at the others. Not noisy. There. Okay. The more busy you put there, the better it will uh, become. It will, be, it will look good. So I'm going to put some white. So here, let's just put some highlights here on this tree. There. support uh, something like a lag there or something like that okay yeah so small things there but it looks really it but it, it looks realistic I mean that part so yeah it's really really nice even on the distance everyone everything just green and I think it looks good I I did justice on this uh, painting, so yeah. So I like it. Uh, I mean, it's uh, just very, very fast. I think uh, just one hour and I finish this one. Sometimes being having a noisy neighbor, it helps me to do it faster. <laughs> okay, but uh, I don't like it also because I cannot teach you better. So I'm gonna. Put uh, also some details here. There, and then I'm going to put more. everyone okay there you go 
so I think I am done and for one hour I finished this painting it looks good for me it looks realistic I like those mountains there and everything there I like it so hopefully we're not distracted with the sounds of my back on my background the neighbors and yeah uh, I did it good I'm very very happy with the result and yeah, I think uh, I give justice so thank you everyone thank you for being here with me thank you hopefully you are you gain a lot of things that you understand and you can paint your own volcano okay everyone so i want to say thank you for watching this video today and i hope you get something out of this and my only advice is to keep on practicing keep on painting the more you do it the more you know how to use your brush the more you will know how to mix the colors that's why i'm using limited colors with palette because i want you to learn how to, learn how to mix and get the desired colors you want so please hit like and some comments subscribe for more videos in the future Okay, once again, thank you. Have a nice day and God bless you all. All the glory and honor and praises always belongs to the Lord.